Firefighters! Hey class, how's everyone feeling today? Good. Good. Okay, amazing. 
Glad to hear it. I'm curious. What do you guys want to be when you grow up? What about you? A builder and a scientist. Wow, that sounds so cool. Astronaut. An astronaut? What about a you? A teacher. A teacher? Amazing. A firefighter. A firefighter? Yeah. Fantastic. All right, we have a little surprise for you today then. We have a real firefighter joining us today. Everyone say hi to Darcy. Hi. Hi, my name is Darcy. I'm a Vaughn firefighter, and I heard that you guys have lots of questions for me today. What's it like driving a firefighter truck? Driving a fire truck is a really big responsibility and it can be a lot of fun. It can be really challenging to get such a big vehicle into different places, especially in a big city, but uh, it's a lot of fun. Is being a firefighter scary? Being a firefighter definitely can be scary. We're put in a lot of different stressful situations. It's a really rewarding job, but you definitely have to be brave. What's it like saving a person? Saving a person is usually, it's a really scary situation and really high stress. Um, it's obviously very rewarding. However, it's a really dangerous situation usually. Do you go home at the end of the day or do you stay at the firehouse? So our shifts are 24 hours. We work 7 a.m. till 7 a.m. the next day. So we do sleep here. There's beds for us. We do get a lot of night calls though. So there's not a ton of sleep happening, but we go home every morning. Yeah, um, how long are the hoses? Our hoses come in a lot of different lengths, um, depending on what we need them for. We have some that are one fire truck length and some that are 100 fire truck lengths. Um, are your suits very heavy? So our suits are called bunker gear and we have a jacket and pants. We also have our air pack. Um, so everything alone can weigh up to 50 pounds and they're really, really heavy. Uh, what's your favorite kind of ice cream? My favorite type of ice cream is mint chocolate chip. I definitely love it. However, I have to say I'm more of a cake person than an ice cream person. I like the mango flavor. Neapolitan. Every t type of ice cream except mint. Chocolate. I have a lot of different, like maybe strawberry, vanilla, chocolate. Fantastic. You guys are making me hungry now. Thank you so much for all your great questions. And Darcy, thank you so much for joining us and answering them. Thanks so much for coming, everybody. It was really awesome to get all your questions. And I hope that you guys stop by the fire station sometime. We will talk to you all soon. Bye, everyone. Bye. 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 Fire! <laughs> Hydrant! <laughs> Smoke detector! Helmet. Fire extinguisher. Fire. Ladder. Fire truck. Water bucket. Fire alarm. Helmet. Fire extinguisher. First aid kit. Hydrant.
Today, the whole town is invited to the fire station for a picnic. Acorn buys an ice cream cone at the food table. Acorn buys a hot dog at the food table. Meanwhile, Miso climbs into a fire truck. She gets to turn on the lights. She gets to sit in the driver's seat. Inside the fire station, Jack, Junja, and Harvey try on some gear. The gear's really heavy, especially the oxygen tank. The gear's really heavy, especially the big jacket. Out on the lawn, the friendly firefighters teach about fire safety. Robin learns to test smoke detectors twice a year. Robin learns to never play with matches. Robin learns to keep a fire extinguisher in the house. Ginger wants to be a firefighter someday. She wants to drive a fireboat. She wants to fly an airplane. Harvey says he likes to help put out wildfires. Harvey says he likes to help save people in emergencies. At the end of the picnic, they all get presents from the firefighters. Jack's favorite gift is the fire helmet. Everyone gathers for a photo in front of the fire station. What a great day to celebrate firefighters. The end. A fire truck is noisy when it is heading to a fire.
spider gear. Station ahead. 